Robberies happen more often than Chicagoans like, but it is rare to have a string of them like this to report. Right, three crimes targeting women and their credit cards, but in each, the getaway vehicle is a rented U-Haul truck. CBS 2's Chris Ty live in Chicago's Edgewater neighborhood with new details on what's going on. Chris? Joe, Marie, this has now happened three times over two days. We're talking just Monday and Tuesday, and two of those were in broad daylight. And that getaway vehicle does anything but blend in. Another call to witness the female get robbed and beat up. It's 11.30 Monday morning on Bittersweet Place, one block from Lakeshore Drive in Buena Park. One bold criminal targets a 62-year-old woman, stealing, among other things, her credit card. I pushed the woman down, snatched the purse, fled. Fled using a U-Haul box truck. CBS2 has learned the truck was rented days ago from this U-Haul station 15 miles away in Chicago's South Shore neighborhood. A getaway vehicle police say would be used two more times in the next 36 hours. A man in a U-Haul rental truck robbed a female. They got out of the van, grabbed her items. Took her purse and bag. Midday Tuesday, four miles north of the first crime, this time Chicago's Edgewater neighborhood, again blocks from Lakeshore Drive on the 5900 block of Kenmore. This time a 72 year old woman is the target. This time the U Haul driver wouldn't wait so long to strike again. At 9 39 Tuesday night, police say he struck again, this time targeting a 49 year old woman in Lakeview on Pine Grove. Sources tell me police have a photo and a license plate of that truck in question, but its driver has yet to be found. Three locations, all close to Lakeshore Drive. Three female victims, none injured. Weapons not used in this crime spree, but one of the most conspicuous getaway vehicles imaginable used in all three. Again, that truck and that driver still out there. The folks at U-Haul say they are working with Chicago police to try to bring this thing to a close. If you have any information, you're also asked to reach out to CPD tonight. We're live on the north side. Chris Ty, CBS 2 News. Chris, thank you so much.